Today, we're going to talk about five proven techniques to skyrocket your closing rates. Hello there and welcome back. It's Francois from HowToBecomeMore.com. Before we go on, before I go into those five segments, I want to tell you something. If you are winging it, if you don't have a script or at least a sequence of things to do when you're speaking to someone to enroll them on whatever it is that you're doing, you're coming short and you're leaving too much money on the table. And I'll tell you a little bit more about it as you stay till the end. So let's look into those five segments right off the bat. Number one, segment one, understand your prospects. You see, to close a deal, you need to understand your prospect at, at a much deeper level. What they need are, what their desires are, and most importantly, what's their pain point. If you can bridge the gap between what it is that they want and where it is that they want to go, and the gap in between all of these things, the more you emphasize it, the better you'll be able to tailor your presentation that will resonate with them. Segment number two, active listenings. Too often, we often thinking so much of what we're gonna say next that we're not really hearing what they're saying. Hence what I said before, if you don't have a script or at least a sequence of things to do and you're not sure about it, then you're thinking more about what you're gonna say next. That's a big mistake. People feel misunderstood when you do that. So become a master listener to show your customers that you really, truly value their input, making them more likely to trust and like you and buy from you because they feel good with you. Segment number three, overcome objections. Oftentimes people say, oh, objections, I hate objections. Let's reframe this right now. Objections is just a way that people are telling you, hmm, I'm not convinced yet. I see myself doing this, but I have some doubt. So their objections are just them voicing out that they're doubting. So instead of seeing objections as roadblocks, view them as opportunity to showcase your proven solving skills. And as you address those objections with confidence and with the solution tailored to your prospect need, they're gonna say, wow, now I really understand that I need to have this now. Segment number four, building rapport. You see, building rapport is a fourth technique and it is a technique and it's a learned one. People buy from those they know, like, and trust. We've all heard this. So take the time to establish a genuine connection with your prospects. Remember, it's not just the sale. It's about building long-term relationships. Think about it. If you're talking to someone and you're looking for a transaction, if it doesn't happen, you both lose. But if you build a relationship, maybe they're not ready for it yet. Maybe you're not ready for theirs yet, but you might know someone that might be on giving a referral later to them. So I'll do a look at a one-on-one, -on -one, but one to many and building rapport is what builds that bridge. Number five segment, closing with confidence. You need to close with confidence. May I make a secret to you? You'll never need to close if you do those four original techniques that we just talked about. Why? Because as people feel understood and they realize where they are to where they want to go, the gap in between it all, and that you're building the bridge to fill that gap and they trust, know and like you because of the rapport that you've been and demonstrated your expertise in easing their pain, it's gonna work like magic. No closing necessary. People says, I'm interested. And so it's fantastic. And as you do this, it's the moment of truth, but it comes from the other way around. It's not closing with confidence. It's them buying with confidence because they want to buy from you. Remember at the beginning, I said, I have something for you while well, I do. Let me review your script or structure that you're using when you're speaking to prospects as you want to enroll them. There might be some flaws in there or things that can be tweaked. I'm ready and willing to explore them with you. So below this video is going to be a link for you to come in. 30 minutes. Let's chat a little bit and maybe 20 minutes of looking at your script. I'll bring some insights that you've never thought of. I've been doing this 44 years. And by doing so, we'll help you get things to the next level. So you can know, like, and trust me. You got it? That's the way to do it. Excellent. So remember, it's not about selling. 
It's about helping your customers solve their problems. If you found this video that's helpful, don't forget to like it, subscribe, and hit notification bell so you can be notified every time a new video comes out each and every week. I value you. I know that you're there to make a difference and I want to help you make it in a better way. So don't forget, you have an offer right below. Click the link. Let's find the time together and stop leaving money on the table and serve more people because you can. Until next time, make it a good one.